Alright, hey guys, how's it going? This is the Vacaville iPhone King. And today I'm going to talk to you about rooting, perm root with S off on your T Mobile HTC G2, aka Desire Z, aka Vision. Um, I'm going to show you guys how to do this without a PC. Um, the first thing you're going to want to go do is go to the Android Marketplace and get Opera Mini Browser as well as Android Terminal Emulator. Those are the only two things you're going to need from the market. Um, get those. Don't do anything with them. Just get them. And then follow me to the next step. You are going to open Opera Mini. It, you're going to get it set up real quick. Just hit accept, whatever. And then you're going to Google G2 Root XDA. Just like that. Okay, hopefully it comes up for you the same way, but you got this one right here, and it's in blue, guide, perma, root, and S off, both manually, manually, or if you used, I want you to go ahead and click on that. You are going to have to have a uh, valid XDA account to download from here it's free and there's not a lot involved I think it's just your email address and a password and username so here's what you're gonna want from this site here you're gonna wanna download hboot eng dot img just tap that and it's gonna download just like this and that's where you want it you want it to your SD card the root of your SD card I already have it but that's what you do there now I'm thinking this doesn't really matter anymore but it did before um, you're probably gonna want the WP this OTA KO I don't think anybody's pre OTA since it was last year so you're going to also want to download that file <clears throat> now now you're going to go ahead and google again but this time I want you to add the word ROM to it. And you are looking for Try this. This next site is also where you're going to follow the instructions from. Here it is, right here. In this one, you've got this one that says guide how to root unroot s off and flash roms you want to click on that 
It's going to take you to another XDA developer page. Now from here, as you can see, it's got this thing that says, Visionary was removed from the market. Please download it from here instead. I want you to go ahead and click on that. And as you can see, you are going to save that as well. Now, when you finish downloading, it's going to ask you to open. What I want you to do is make sure that in your settings for your device, under applications that you have check mark the box that says unknown sources that is going to allow you to download or install visionary uh, once it's finished downloading just hit open and it should go right to the install page for that now you're gonna to want to keep this page. You're gonna to want to keep this page close by, cause it's, or open it on a computer or another device. If you have an iPod Touch like I did, that's how I did it. Um, so once you've downloaded those, I want you to go ahead and come in here, and you should have Visionary. It's this yellow one here. It's a triangle. I'm already rooted, but what you're going to do is you're going to hit, you're going to uh, make sure that temp root on boot and set system read write after root are checked, and then you're going to temp root now. That's going to temp root you. It's also going to give you super user and all that other stuff. So when, once you've done that, then you're going to open up the Android terminal emulator which looks like this and from there I just want you to follow the instructions on this last one that we were using and it's going to tell you in these boxes exactly what to type and what it's going to do. Now, something they didn't tell you in here that I'm going to tell you. You see SU and then CD slash SD card. Those are spaces, in case you're wondering. So those are spaces. Type those in there if it looks like a space. Um, it tells you that you're going to get an error after one of them, but that's what you want. Sync now after that's all done then you're gonna go back to visionary temp root again and then attempt perm root although being that we're doing this from the phone I don't think we have to temp root again you should just be able to go straight through and perm root from there and after that you're perm rooted and s off no computer needed. If you write down the stuff you've got to type into the Android emulator, you won't even need a, another phone or anything. You just write it down and then type it in. And just so you guys have proof, this is the T-Mobile G2. I'm running stock. And here's a application from the marketplace called root check oops root check and we're going to verify root access and root check has been granted and we have root access and if I was to boot up into the 
recovery, you would see an S off. So you could use a different SIM card. Anyway, this has been the back of the iPhone King with the easiest way to perm root and S off your T-Mobile HTC G2. I will post direct links to the pages that you need in the description below. Remember to rate, comment, and subscribe. Because without you, there is no vacuum of the iPhone King. Peace.